Uh, hey, Don, what are you uh, what are you looking for in the cupboard there? Well, the three of us here are looking for that TV thingy. You know the TV thingy? No. It goes on the back of the TV to put the TV outside. Oh, the thing. we're gonna try to mount our outside TV? That thingy. Oh, you mean the TV that doesn't come with the rig, but the mount does? Oh, there it is. Hey, let's find Yay. out. This should be a quick video, but we're gonna show you how to do this. All right. Alrighty. But I don't even know if our TV will work. All right, we'll let you know. All right, grab the dogs, and uh, I don't know what you do with them. <laughs> Maybe give, we're going to give them a bath. Y'all want a bath? <laughs> <laughs> So you just bought your brand new RV and you're all excited. And hey, it's got an outside TV mount. No, it does Yes, it Yay. does. Hey, exciting. And we just happen to have an old TV sitting here. All right, just out of the bedroom. And uh, it's got the four holes. That's what you're looking for in the back, four holes. And this is what you get when they tell you you got an outside TV mount. You get this bracket right here. And that's what you're gonna wanna put on the back of this TV. So we're gonna bolt that on, actually screw it on. And then they also give you this little cable that's gonna go to the hookup. We'll show you all that on the outside. But this should be a real simple procedure, except for the fact that in the RV industry, they give you stuff like this bracket, but they don't give you any screws to go in those holes. Uh, but the TV that came with our rig is not uh, the original TV that should have been in there, but it's a replacement because we bought our rig uh, during COVID. So it came with this Hisense TV instead of the uh, upscale uh, RV brand. And uh, anyway, the TV works great. But with that TV, we got four screws. So I'm going to hope that those four screws fit those ho four holes on a completely different TV from inside the house. What are the odds that they're universal? <laughs> hey! I'm thinking not likely. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to try. This will take just a couple of seconds, and we'll be right back. Woohoo! Okay, so we're back and we got this uh, bracket here that they give you for your outside TV. We got our TV laying on a towel. You don't want to hurt your uh, LCD or LED screen or whatever TV you're using. And you put the back bracket on the back and you want to find those four holes. There's four holes here. You want to line them up because these brackets are universal. And I got that corner. It looks like we're going to go for those four. Let's see. No. Nope. All right, I had it a second ago. Let's see there. All right, now we're getting it. There we go. I'm actually getting these four inside right here. All the holes lined up now. And let's go ahead and try these magical screws. Are these universal between all TVs? Let's find out. That's going to be a Phillips. Real quick here. I don't want to make you sit around too long watching a video about how to put a bracket on TV. And they are going to be universal. Wow! No. Hey! I can't believe that worked. Unbelievable. All right. Well, we'll get all four of those on, and we're going to come back and be outside and show you how quick this really is to get your very own outside TV in your RV where they don't give you all the stuff to do it from the manufacturer. You go ahead and you line it up with your outside and just slide down. Of course, you do it when the camera's not on. That's always the rule. Okay. There we go. Right in there. That's nice. Okay. So you got to put your little cable on. That goes in right down here. You just pop that open. This will connect you to your uh, rooftop RV antenna. And of course, on the other side, if you're at a park, you can uh, be plugged into cable. And you'll get all the cable channels right out here. So you want to watch your big race or your football game or soccer. There you go. You just plug in. And that, like I say, immediately goes to the upstairs, the roof antenna. And if you were at a park, uh, you'd be able to just uh, go ahead and hook up right to cable. And you'd come right out here to your outside. So that's neat. All right. Well, we got the TV hooked up in that bracket. And, uh, man, I was so glad those uh, screws, apparently, for the... Uh, uh, brackets for the televisions are universal, so that's great to know. Anyway, we're all plugged into the cable. That should be up to my uh, TV antenna. 
Uh, it's plugged into the power. The proof is in the pudding. Let's push on. On. <laughs> hey, it's starting. It said smart TV. Maybe it got dumb. No. Okay. It's trying to find a channel. We don't have that channel. I wonder if I have to re-scan. Uh, I bet I do. Oh, Results no, there we go. Resonate hey. deeply with most of us. We feel... All right. Hey, we caught a fish. <laughs> hey, Rick. How's it going, buddy? All right, so there you go. Yes, I think it's funny as well. It is funny. Outdoor TV, there you go. Hopefully, that was just Look a quick little that. video. And, uh... Yes, it's funny. We hope you enjoyed it. I'm the bear. And I'm done. And we are Adventures Adventures. <laughs> hey! Well, if we ever get a van channel. We are, <laughs> we are Adventures in Xanadu. And that is your outdoor TV setup, hookup. And uh, get out there and uh, go watching TV in the wilderness. <laughs> All right, we'll talk to you later. We hope you find your Xanadu. Toodaloo!